this is Henito and today we are playing the Born of Bread standalone demo. Uh, if you haven't heard of Born of Bread, it's a fantastic looking Paper Mario inspired RPG game. And let's just get into it. Uh, not the same game, but this is kind of giving me uh, Silent Hill downpour starting vibes for some reason. Maybe because we're on a bus. We're here. Let's go. Step out one by one. Whoa. So this is the Forest of Roots. Pretty neat, huh, Loaf? All right, people. As your guide, I have to ask you to always keep your eyes on me and stick to the group. Although it may look pers peaceful, this forest holds many mysteries and dangerous creatures. Vicious and scary ones at that. What, like monsters? Yes, Lint, with teeth, claws, and all. So, you and Loaf stay close, alright? Anyway, today's expedition will take us to a very safe place. Flapwing Village. Oh my god, look at that guy's little face. Look at him. Oh, he's so scared. Bread, on the other hand, looks completely cool. Or Loaf. I think his name is Loaf. It's the oldest settlement in the Forest of Roots. In fact, it has barely changed in the past hundred years. It's an excellent opportunity to study these fascinating dwellers in their natural habitat and learn more about the cultures of rural settlements. The brochure said there would be birds fighting? Ah, yeah. Uh, one of Lapwing's customs involves fights. But you'll find the history behind it very interesting. So, without any more delay, please, follow me. I'm so excited. I've been hearing stories about the Forest of Roots ever since I was a kid. You mean you're not still a kid? Because you kind of look like a kid to me. They say that deeper in the forest, there are small islands on the roots of the biggest trees. And at the base of the roots, there's the undergrowth, a super scary place hidden from the sun and full of toxic water. For some reason, he thinks that's a thumbs up. Yeah, you're right. It'd be a good inspiration for one of my stories. But I'm good with hearsay. Sound way too dangerous. I'm with you, uh, foxy kid, raccoon thing. What are you looking at? You're stressing me out. Ah, it's thieves. What? You saw thieves? Ho oh, ho! So great is the call of learning that I almost forgot the keys inside the bus. Ah, uh, about that, Professor. <coughs> Beryl, you brainless dingbat! Would you believe I know all about the geopolitical geopolit aspects of the 12th Food War, but I can't even remember to keep my keys on me? Going after them? No, 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 no. Splitting up from the group would be ill-advised. Have you had a good look at them? Good, let's go to the village and hope somebody there knows something about the hooligans. Nonsense, we should definitely just... Just stake out on our own and just go for them. Okay, now what's this? Interact, select, jump, move, run, pause menu. Ah... Ooh, look at it! Look at it! Oh my god. Oh my god, it's... Oh, whoop. Uh, uh, yeah, okay, water bad. Uh, in a Paper Mario S game, water bad. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. <gasps> Look at that. Oh, we got a nice close-up of our handsome face. Excellent. <laughs> I'm way too happy about this. But look at it. It's adorable. <gasps> it's adorable. It's adorable. Okay. Uh, so we're supposed to go that way, but I want to come over here. Wait, it's dangerous out there. Didn't you hear Professor Beryl? We need to go to the village. Oh, okay. So you're not going to let me just wander off. Well, okay. Fair enough. I guess that'll wait for the full game. What's this? Why is it sparkly? I guess, I guess we can't do anything with that right now, but it looks sparkly. Oh, there's a little 
little little sparkly thing there too. This forest is very sparkly and I have no objections to that whatsoever. Hey guys, what are you doing? That uh, that gate looks uh, very locked. You wouldn't be planning to uh, break in, would you? Uh, do you need a do you need a fourth and a fifth for that? Because uh, we're up for it. Hello. Ah, this isn't very rustic looking. What are those badgers building here? What a jerk. Yeah, how can anyone be such a piece of baloney? What's going on? Our friend just locked us out of our property. He won't even acknowledge us. We don't know why he would do that. We were coming back from our shift in the village and found the gate locked. If only there was a way to get past that dumb fence. Ooh, I wonder if there's a way to get past that dumb fence. Maybe we can find a way for them. Okay, let's go to the village. There were many attempts to colonise the Forest of Roots, but all have failed. Mmm, mm, look at that tree. Cool. Mm, mm, mm. Um, um, Elder, the tourists from Royal Tan have arrived. Mm, the snag's mine. Oh my. I'm terribly sorry. Mm. Welcome, I am the elder of this here Lapwing village. I do hope your visit here will be pleasant. Mm. And I'm the elder's assistant, Koo. Please follow me, I'll be showing you around. Pardon me, elder. Something happened and we need your help. Mm. What's this now? Is, is it those nasty badges again? No, at least I don't think so. Some hooligans stole the keys to our tour bus. Loaf, go ahead and describe what you saw. Cool. You don't say, young peep. Yes, yes. You have been the victim of the Rockoon Gang. Those rascals have been causing havoc all, over, all around the forest for a while now. Cool. If I remember right, there are three raccoons, each one more tricky than the last. They sound like a mean bunch. Hmm? Cool. You're one of them, Cool. Their leader, Cool. What? No. Elder, this is a misunderstanding, surely. Our friend Lint here is certainly not a miscreant. Hmm, hmm, Cool. Oh, my apologies. You do share a striking resemblance with their mm, leader, Cool. If only we knew. The Raccoon Gang is near impossible to find, cool. Although we haven't looked outside the village, hmm. Yes, I'm not very far then, have you? Hmm, if you want to look for them, come see me by the Chikitsu Arena, cool. I may be old, but I can teach you some useful tricks, cool. Well, I'll leave this up to you boys. You can find me pretty much anywhere where there are interesting things to learn. Oh, and try not to get yourself in too much trouble, all right? Okay, so we're the strangers in the village who are going to end up solving their problems for them because they couldn't be asked to look outside their village for a group of uh, miscreants. Oh, what's this? Oh, bouncy mushrooms. Excellent. Ooh, what's over here? Yeah, if you couldn't tell, this sort of game is is really my bag. It's excellent. I loved Paper Mario. Cuckoo! -coo. Looking for the Elder? His house is the highest one over there. Thank you for that. What's here? Can I... Ooh, I can go in. Hello. We lost our ability to fly a long time ago by settling by this lake. Thankfully, cool, the mushrooms here are super bouncy. If we want to get up high, we just need to find the right mushroom. Nice. By the way, if you're wondering why um, I did a voice for the Elder when I don't usually do voices and I'm not doing one for anyone else, uh, the answer is I don't know. I suddenly got possessed by Dr. Evil. Uh, oops, and um, oops, uh, yes. Not a fan of... Um, Oh my god, look, I look I look like I've been punched in the face. Vicious. Aw. Poor poor little man. If I can get some sort of healing from somewhere. 
What's that cool sword over there? Hmm, that young peeps is the Indigo Gladius. Cool. It's been here stuck in those ruins for as long as any lapwing can remember. Nobody can remove it from there? Cool. Many have tried and all have failed. Hmm. You see, this Gladius is incomplete and therefore will not move. Its spirits are missing. Spirits? Like ghosts? Yes, hmm. Its power comes from three spirits that, are, that used to reside inside the grip. They scattered long ago, cool, and now they're lost. How do you know all this? Hmm, the Gladius can still whisper, cool. It wants to be whole again. It told me so in my dreams, hmm. Uh, well, those are both kind of answers that are a bit rude. Uh, you crazy old bird. You got that right, young peep. Hmm. If you can find the missing spirits, cool. I'm positive the Indigo Gladius could finally be freed. Oh, interesting. So we need to find spirits for the sword. Easy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, right? Careful, guys. This machine is no joke. It'll flatten you in no time. My friend Loaf is super squishy. I'm sure he'll be okay. Your body's a temple. Respect it. Uh, good, good. Hey, ooh. Uh, well. Ah, okay. Well, yep. Um, uh, that's, uh, yeah, yeah. Sure. Uh, does that have a purpose? Can I use that? Like to get into a different area or something? Is it useful? Can I use this? Oh, interesting. Hi, can I talk to you? Oh, I just don't know what I'll do, Coo. What's wrong? My precious teacup handed out over generations of lapwings is stuck in my old nest. Oh no, did you forget it there? Yes, Coo. Those mean badgers forced us out of our nest to build a camping lodge here. I was so stressed that I forgot my teacup. We'll help you out, right, Loaf? You're so kind. Thank you, thank you. Thank you again for finding some time for me, Coo. Ah, you're more than welcome, little birdie. So, the badgers are actually forcing the birds off their land? That doesn't seem right. In fact, that seems downright terrible. Can I? Covered in rubble. I never looked at or searched for. Back to my dwelling. Huh? What? Did I just... Did I... Wait. Did I just meet a spirit? Uh, oh, I see. Oh, I see. I need to get squished. Hi, right, just, uh, just squishy-wishy me. Thank you. I have, a. Uh... Whoop! Ha ha! Here we go! An old teacup carefully kept in excellent condition. Excellent. Very good. Oh, and we just destroyed that. Hi! Your nest's open again if you want to go in there. We got your teacup back. Oh, Cuckoo! Thank you so much! I'm so happy now. Here, please accept this. A new pungent look for loaf. I'm so excited to drink my evening tea with my precious teacup. What do you mean I... A new look? Okay, have I... Oh, I've got a mustardy shirt now. Wasn't that nice? Yes, we'll, we'll have the mustard shirt, thank you. Uh, we, we are done with the ketchup for now. Ah, how goes your trip so far? This is nice. Well, I'm glad you're enjoying yourselves. My colleagues hate giving tours, but I find them refreshing. At any rate, I have some fascinating facts about the village if you're ever interested. Uh, no thanks, not during the demo, maybe the full game. Hello? Well wait! Hey Dub, weren't you busy at the Savers Guild yesterday? The heroes I got assigned got sick, so I came here to help you out. Here, you forgot your battle cards at the Savers Guild yesterday. Collectible cards with heroes printed on them. If you're lucky, you might get a holographic one. I know, I know Loaf tends to forget his battle moves sometimes, so I brought the cards back here to help you remember them. Uh, also, I heard through the grapevine that you might be training in the arena soon. 
Don't forget, we savers have the responsibility to record and share all progress made by our adventurers. So I hope you don't mind if I stream your fight. Sure. Uh, I value my internet privacy. <laughs> Good one, Loaf. Internet privacy. What even is that? Haha. <laughs> Alright, here's the Elder. He's in two places. He's up on the hill and he's also down here. Are you ready to learn the ancient art of Chikitsu? Oh, I like your enthusiasm, young peep. Hmm. Pardon the saying, but you do look squishy. Do you have a weapon? Hmm, yes, a ladle or cool. A fine weapon. Make sure to always equip your weapons before battle. Open your menu with start, cool. Select your ladle and place it in your backpack. Okay. So, where is our ladle? Here's our ladle, and it is now in our backpack. Hmm. Be mindful of the weapons you bring in battle. You can't carry everything at once. On guard. Oh wow, this is this is so Paper Mario. I love it. Cool. Hmm. I see you have your Savers Guild official battle cards. Good. They'll help you pick actions against your opponents. Hmm. Why don't you try making the first move, young people? Select the attack card and use your ladle on me. Don't worry, I can take it, cool. Okay, uh, then I pick attack. Mixes soup and bonks the enemy pretty well. Oosh. Hmm, that wasn't half bad. Now it's your friend's turn. Humor me and use his brainstorm ability. Cool. Brainstorm? Uh, okay. Share your ideas with your friends. Hold and release the left stick at the correct time. Hold and release. Um. Okay. Hmm, cool, yes, see, this ability used up some of your will points. They are needed to perform most of your normal attacks. Cool, it's my turn now. Try to block my attack by pressing A at the right moment. Hmm, see, when you block an attack, you won't take any damage from it. But remember to wait until the very last moment, cool. Timing is key. I have a question. How are we supposed to win back will and resolve after spending it on our attacks? Hmm, I do believe the battle broadcast can help with that. But you'll have to speak to Dub about it, cool. Technology is mumbo jumbo to me. Oh, but there is something I do know. Select your defend card and press A just before my attack, like last time. You gained one will point from that, hmm? Notice the difference between blocking and defending. Now you know the basics, cool. Hmm, you are disciplined, young peeps. Here, one of my fellow lapwings found this the other day, cool. It'll be more useful to you than to me. A tool used by the lapwing druids long ago. Watch out, it's sharp. Ooh. Thanks, Elder. Some weapons are stronger on certain enemies, while others less effective, cool. Experiment and learn. Hmm. Hmm, right. Your raccoon problem, cool. They're very elusive, you see. Help people around the forest and you just might find them. Who look around and ask people, hmm? Maybe somebody has seen the Raccoon Gang lately. Who? 
Sorry to bother you again, good guys. Just a quick word about the b battle broadcast. If you battle well, viewers will become happy and give you will points from time to time. But if you do b bad, they'll be angry and won't give you anything. If you want to save your p progress, come and see me and I'll record it. Awesome, thank you for that. Oh, hello. There are little butterflies. Oh. Oh, hello. Oh, 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 oh. oh, thank you very much. That is very useful. Oh, is this money? This is money. Awesome. I wanted money. And what is that? Gimme. Whatever, whatever that was. Fruit, heart fruit. Uh, I can't give it to... Oh. Okay. I, I couldn't give it to me, but I gave it to my little raccoon friend. That's fine. Hey, why did you lock your friends outside? My house is lame. Theirs is way better. They wouldn't accept a trade. I made the choice for them. Huh, okay. Why do you think your house is lame? It doesn't have a door, and it's all dirty and unfinished and stuff. Sounds like you're just lazy. You're lame too. Wow. You really are a piece of baloney. What'd you say? Uh, that you were a piece of baloney? That ain't true. I'm gonna show you all that I'm grade A meat, okay? Here, they can have their stupid house back. Mine's gonna be way cooler. Okay, didn't know you guys were trading houses. Oh, I see. So this is their house. And this is his house. Wow, it really is a bar ship. Okay. Whoa, you did it, guys. Thank you so much for talking some sense into our friend. Battle broadcast generates two WP when the meter is filled. Nice. It's going to be nice relaxing in our home. Okay, but you didn't give me any information? I gained nothing from that. Literally nothing. By the pond I slept, sheltered from the sun by trees. Back to my dwelling. Okay, that's the second time that's happened. Am I releasing spirits or what is going on? I have no clue. Hello. Can I talk to you? Welcome to our mine, proudly operated by us badgers for generations now. What are you digging for? We're looking for all sorts of ores, but the most valuable thing in there is a very rare crystal only found in the Forest of Roots. Cool, does it do anything special? It's a crystal, kid. It glows in the dark and it's pretty. What were you expecting? Oh, um, I don't know. Like, it could be a conduit to the Earth's energy or hold some mystical power, you know. Some wild imagination you got there, kid. Now buzz off. Wow. Rude. These badges are rude. Can I uh, get this money that's in your minecart? Thank you. Hello. The Rock Goon Gang? Yeah, I've seen them. They always loiter around our mine, freaking kids. I even caught them inside one time, but I kicked them out real fast. Nobody fools around in our mine. Well, until those monsters showed up, I guess. You said there were m monsters inside the mine? Yep, creepy things. Never seen anything like them in my entire life. Everything was A-OK -okay just a couple of days ago, then BAM! The mine's full of them. It's pretty dangerous now. I figured I'd take some time off to figure things out. Let's try and go in. Let's see if we can uh, defeat some of these monsters for them. Weapons are meant to hurt. Well, thank you for that, yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You kids are going in there? Are you crazy? Something is sapping the power, so the mines are even spookier than before. Not only that, but the monsters here are super tough. You'd better head back, kid. Wow, the nerve of some folk. Look, don't, don't, don't warn me. I, I want to, I want to be in danger. I want to be squished. Like a piece of dough that I am. Look at that. Excellent. I love that mechanic. Oh, hello.
Oh, I see. So there's like a fake Twitch chat going on. Okay, let's attack. Uh, with the Druid Sickle, maybe? Drop as fast as possible. Okay. Uh, tail whack. Chat is still bored though. Oh my god, he killed me. Well, that's not very good, is it? Okay, this time maybe we don't go in the mine. We're gonna go and see what else is. Ooh. Here we go. Well, I was going to say we're going to wait and see what else is around, but here you go. Ow. Okay, I didn't manage to block any of that. It's fine. Nice. These enemies are a lot easier, so this is what we were probably supposed to do. Oh, we just picked up his uh, cupcake. Well, that's fine. I've been having issues with my wood stove recently. Whenever I light it, it smokes the whole place. Something must be stuck in the pipe. Mind looking for me, pals? It's a bit weird to just ask two strangers to do that for you. Oh, come on. It's all dirty and dusty in there. And what if it's a wild animal that got stuck and died there? No thanks. So you want two kids to deal with it. You guys will have dealt with it in no time, I'm sure. I'll let you keep whatever's blocking the pipe. Aha, we can get up here. Oh, can we, um... Oh. So is that... Was that what was blocking his chimney? Just a bunch of soot? My wood stove is finally unclogged. This thing fell out of it. Thanks, pals. Oh, cool. So we can increase our HP. Uh, a fruit so tasty it adds years to your life. Permanently adds 3 HP to your buddy. Okay, so this is what we gave our buddy last time. Oh, I see. Well, we'll have that instead of instead of the cosmetic then, I guess. I'm hungry, kid. Just uh, bring me something to eat, yeah? Something salty, fat, tasty. Yeah, yeah. Something real tasty. Hmm, okay, so what, what could we bring him that's salty and tasty? Cool. So I think we've got all the spirits of that sword now. we leveled up and it's got that Mario Party sort of party vibe um max will up max resolve up let's increase our will uh, since we seem to keep running out of that boon slot or backpack slot let's go for a boon slot Hmm, what to do, what to do. What's up, mister? I'm looking for a ring to give to my fiancé, and then there's the perfect one in the mine. It was forged by a master badger, and into this ring he poured his passion, his romance, and his will to love all life. Okay, so not the one ring, then. How romantic. Yeah, right? But I don't know where it is in the mine, and there's a bunch of monsters walking around. We could go look for it. Really? Whoa, you guys rock. Okay, well, I guess we have no choice but to venture into the mine again, which worked out so well last time. Oh, wow. This time we're descending. Oh my god. That looks, that looks bad. That looks really bad. Let's try it. I keep trying to jump on them. 
because my br my Super Mario brain tells me that would be the best option to jump on them. Resisted? Well, that's not very good, is it? Oh, nice. He's weak to that attack for some reason. Oh, there's a pickaxe up there. I want that. I want a pickaxe. How do I get to the pickaxe, though? Clearly not this way. Okay, I think I may have uh, come the wrong way. Look how pretty this is. I mean, it's just amazing. I have to say, this this game, visually, so far, it's just it's just so beautiful. It really is. I can't pull this switch. Oh, I'm guessing there's no power. Can I get this pickaxe though? An ordinary pickaxe. Nothing more, nothing less. Oh, so is that a weapon? It is a weapon. <gasps> I bet this is going to be really good against the rock monsters. It's going to be so good. Just you wait. Now we've got our pickaxe. I think we're going to do really well. Oh. That thing just ran away from us. Oh. I didn't read the description of how to do that. Uh, hold the and release it to throw. Oh, okay. Nice. Perfect. I'm it. <clears throat> oh no, the cable is broken. That's why it doesn't work. Okay, we're gonna have to descend deeper into the mine then. Ow! Son of a mushroom. Speaking of boons, we can be mustered again for now. Oh, um, that guy is getting electrocuted. This guy looks dangerous though, maybe this was a bad idea. Wow, we blocked all of it. So, bro. Nice. Getting the hang of the battling a bit more now. I think it actually took me a while in Paper Mario as well. Awesome. So, we fixed that. Oh, and we got some chocolate cake. That is quite a boon. Ooh, um... Oh! Whose finger was this meant for? It sure is heavy. Oh! Okay, well. There we go. We, uh, we, we did that thing. Oh, okay. We obviously flipped it already. That's fine then. Oh god, it's the... It's the Rock Doom Gang. Shoot, Riff, you idiot, you forgot to put up the fake wall again. Aha, uh -huh. oopsie, my bad, Wrath. We've caught you, you thieves. Whoa, the cute one is getting all intimidating. What you think, Riff? Ah, uh, yeah, he's pretty cute, I guess. Not. Wow, good one, Riff. 
Your dumb keys? We gave them to our boss. The great trash. The sneakiest and coolest raccoon that exists. Yeah, what he said. Once the Rockoon gang gets its paws on something, that's as good as gone. It's as good as gone. You'd better start walking home though. You'd better start walking home, Doeball. Duh oh, haha. <laughs> yeah, well, where's that trash guy anyway? We won't leave without the keys, right, Loof? Shoot, what's the point of this? Listen, normally we'd have kicked your butts a while ago, but something happened to Trash and... We're freaking scared, you guys. Scared? Trash has been obsessed with an ugly vase we found in those creepy ruins over there. He's always down there nowadays, like day and night. We tried bringing him cooler things than that dumb vase, but he says they're just not the same. Yeah, real creepy, like that one time I caught him speaking to that vase. Oh, that really does sound spooky. Not only that, but a bunch of monsters have been popping up ever since we found those ruins hidden behind the wall. We don't know what to do, man. It's freaking weird. What do you think, Loaf? Uh, let's help. You're lucky we're so nice. We'll help you out, but give us back the keys after. Sure, if you bring us back our trash, we'll give you whatever you want. Yeah, yeah, thanks, pals. Loaf, we should probably make sure we're well equipped before we face whatever's down there. Don't worry, my friend. I know exactly what we need for this. We're going to go and we're going to get that sword. Hopefully. Ooh, it looks alive to me. Hmm, cool, cool. Great work, young peeps. The glaive is now whole again. Cool. Claim the fruit of your hard work. Three ominous eyes shaped gems sit in the grip of weird purple glaive. It almost feels alive. Well done. Ooh, this looks spooky. Looks really cool though. This game just looks phenomenal. Like, look, look, look at the light on Loaf. It's great the way it changes as you move. It's just beautiful. It really is. And look at those expressions. So adorable. Adorably horrified. Loaf, look, that must be trash. Yeah, he doesn't look well. And that must be the vase Riff and Raff were talking about. It seems evil. Hey, hey Trash, uh, get away from that thing. Well, we tried. Let's get out of here. Um, you're right. But what are we supposed to do? Nothing. There is nothing you can do. What? It will finally be set free. I give my energy to you, Master. What's going on? Oh well, isn't that thing just um very friendly looking? I'm sure it just wants to uh, come out of its jar and give us a great big hug. Definitely what it wants to do. Oh wow, I love this direction. It's cool. Indigo Gladius. Three ominous iron shaped gents. Okay. Oh, we don't have enough WB, damn it. Okay. Uh, in that case, let's take... Um, a cupcake. Actually, that wasn't enough. We need we need something with a bit more oomph to give us that amount. Ooh, sneaky. Okay. Well, I managed to block two attacks. That's more than I usually do. Okay, so I can only attack this one apparently, that's fine. Nice. Oh god. Well, that was, um, ouch. I mean, technically we should be able to just smash that vase easy peasy, if you ask me. 
Oh, okay, he's summoning minions again. That's fine. I'm going to use this guy to, uh... Oh, God. Now... We need to eat a croissant. Maybe we're just not meant to beat this boss. Oh, my God. He's, he's summoned a very angry-looking bee. I don't think I have anything to bring my companion back. Oh, okay, just give him something. That's fine then. And we're gonna farm some WP points from these guys if I don't mess up the blocking. Nice. Okay, well, you, you, you may be able to be beat that boss, but um, I didn't, and I probably that's probably the end of the demo, I don't know. If you want to play the demo for yourself though, and get further than that, if that's possible, then as I said, the demo is currently up on Itch.io, and I shall leave a link to it in the description below. But yeah, I think this game has so much potential and for anyone who enjoys this kind of aesthetic, enjoys RPG type games, enjoyed Paper Mario and the kind of combat system that it had and the kind of aesthetic, this game is going to be your bag. There's no question about it. But that's all for now from me. So thank you so much for watching. Take care of yourself and stay safe. Until next time. <laughs>